All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to One Game One Life. My name is Typo, and this is Persona 5 Royal, my favorite game of all time. I have a huge smile on my face. This really is, in my opinion, the best game ever. Obviously, that's subjective, not objective, but the gameplay, the story, the characters, the music, the style. Ooh. Even if you don't think this is the best game you've ever played, it is the most stylish game you've ever played. And you can ask anybody who's played the game that, and they will agree. This is the most stylish game ever made. It is beautiful. It's so good. Even just like menus and stuff are just so creative and... Oh my god. It is a fantastic game. Uh, so, if you're unfamiliar with Persona 5, the, there is a calendar system in the game where each day you have a certain amount of things you can do and so you have to value your time and just like you do in real life and what I've been wanting to do for years actually is live alongside Persona 5 as the days move on in Persona 5 so on April 9th I'll play the April 9th of Persona 5 and then I'll put up that recording, and then April 10th, put up that recording, April 11th, etc. And kind of just play a little bit of Persona 5 every day, and whatever happens on that day in the game is what I'll play that day. And it's a stupid idea, <laughs> but it's something I've thought about doing for years, and it's a perfect excuse for me to play Persona 5 Royal again. I'm not kidding, this is, this is it, this is the one. I'm thinking of getting a tattoo of this game. My PlayStation 4 has a Persona 5 Royal skin. I have a Persona 5 Royal mouse pad. I've got a canvas wall art in my room. I geek over this thing, so forgive me if I'm geeking out throughout the playthrough. I'm mostly doing, I'm actually 99% doing this just for me because I know there's probably not a lot of people who are gonna wanna watch Persona 5 Royal. It's, it came out a while ago, back in like 2017. People have moved on or whatever, but I'll never move on from this game. So I'm going to go ahead and get started. I've never played it on PC before, so that'll be what's new for me. And I've only played Royal... Uh, only. I've only played Royal twice before. <laughs> but I played Persona 5 um, twice, and then I played Persona 5 Royal twice. And Persona 5 Royal is kind of like... Uh, think of it as the Game of the Year edition that added more free DLC and stuff like that. But with my broken memory, there will still be parts that even I don't remember. But it is so ingrained in me. Let's go ahead and get started. I'm ready. I'm so ready. Let's go. You're gonna feel the style throughout the whole game. I can't wait. Persona 5 Royal allows you to experience the game with English or Japanese voices. Please select a voice language. Yes, we are going with English. The voice actors are great. No reason to go with Japanese. There's some, like, anime-esque stuff where the English voice actors are terrible, so you want the Japanese dub, but... No, the English voice actors are fantastic. The setting can also be changed... Uh, we're not going to. Thank you. This story is a work of fiction. Similarities between characters or events to persons living or dead in your world are purely coincidental. Imagine I sounded like this. Only those who have agreed to the above have the privilege of partaking in this game. <laughs> so if you hit I do not agree here, you can watch it on YouTube <laughs> somewhere. Uh, it actually just boots you to the main menu and says, oh, I see. Then I guess you're not playing this game. And then it kicks you to the main menu. <laughs> I agree. Yeah. The contract has been sealed. We have to learn all the PC controls. The world is not as it should be. It's filled with distortion and ruin can no longer be avoided. Those who oppose fate and desire change. From time to time, they were referred to as tricksters. You are the trickster. Now is the time to rise against the abyss of distortion. Casino, where it all starts. Here we go. 
I'm just gonna be quiet so y'all can enjoy. Okay, let's see if we can figure this out <laughs> with the PC controls. <laughs> oh my god. It's so good to be back. God, look at that. Stop right there. Take him down, Joker. <laughs> Ooh. Look at this guy. Alright, so this is the uh, combat of the game, which is so clean. Obviously, this is the tutorial. They're not going to throw much at us, but you've got curse damage from our persona. We've got physical damage. Let's go in with Aegon. Gun. <laughs> Light him up. Too slow. Nice dodge. And then we'll just melee attack from there. Wrap it up. Good. You defeated them with ease. More of them? Be careful. Joker behind you. Go through that. Listen to that music. You should be able to get out that way. Hurry! Dude, can you even hear us? Don't worry. I'm picking up everyone's voices. Just go, Joker! Hmm? Wait a sec. What the? I'm getting a weird reading heading your way. Come on, run! The splashes as you run. Um, how do I... Okay, it is the mouse. Perfect. Where'd they go, damn it? I can't confirm the intruder's location. Okay, there's a guy. Is it gonna teach me how to, uh... Huh? Stealth? This is bad. Hi, Joker. How in the shadows sneak past when you see an opening? Yeah, but you didn't tell me how to do that. Look at that. Understood. I'll continue the search. I'm not sure what I'm going to do for voices that don't voice out. We'll see. Now's your chance. Make a run for it. We'll see if I change my mind on what we're doing there. Um, 
PC is canceled. Interesting. How many of them are there? Everything okay? Security level level might rise if you take too much time. You know what? I'm gonna let them. I'm I'm not gonna voice it unless you guys think I should. Again, I don't plan on many people watching this, but <laughs> if you want me to voice them, I guess I can voice them. But for now, I'm just gonna read it. All right, go straight from there. Get the grappling hook out already. It's an enemy right near you. Even you can't take on this many. Huh? Joker, that weird reading from earlier is closing in on you too. I'll end this right now. Joker, it's her! She's the weird reading I've been getting! The music starts up. Make sure it's as stylish as possible, baby. <laughs> My weak self relied on you so much. That ends today. Let's do this, Senpai. Let's light him up. Okay, and by the way, I promise all this will make sense um, in due time. I know they kind of threw you in the deep end if you're following along, but I promise. There is a uh, method to the madness. Dang, let's go. Get him. to interfere. However, please don't forget the promise we made, okay? Joker, you need to get out of there. Go, go, go. Let's go, go, go. All right, let's do it. All right, go up the stairs to the end of the path. There's a little more, so hang in there. <laughs> I said I wouldn't read it out loud, and here I am anyway. Forget it. I don't even know what I want. All I know is I want to play this game. And I won't spoil anything. At least I'll, I'll try not to. Find them and kill them all. Something wrong? The exit should be up ahead. They're there. That's just how it is. After that commotion, the bottom floor is completely closed off. Hey, can you make it? Over there! There's nowhere to run! <laughs> See ya. Off. You're so reckless, you know that? Enemies here? What 
What's wrong? These readings. It can't be. What happened? An ambush? Joker, can you handle this? Joker! Oh no! Capture him! Let's go! Go, go, go! Get over there! Get over there. Oh, shit. Stop struggling. Suspect secure. Didn't expect to find some kid. You have your teammate to thank for this. You were sold out. Suspect confirmed. Cuff it. Guess the drug was too strong. Wake him up. No dozing off. You still don't get it, do you? Give it up! Come on, cooperate! What? You want another shot? Huh? What about the camera? Are you thinking it can be used as video evidence? A little police brutality never hurt nobody, right? I ain't giving you words. You hear my question? Answer! <coughs> Obstruction of justice, blackmail, defamation, possession of weapons. Manslaughter too, yeah? Talk about the works. To think that all those crimes were led by a punk like this. You seem to be enjoying every second of it. Huh? I was enjoying it? Everything's hazy, I can't remember. Normal difficulty all the way. I will be playing this one game, one life, just because that's how I enjoy playing games. I'm fairly confident we'll be okay, but if Joker goes down, it's game over. So... Normal seems good. For those who want balance between exciting gameplay and a riveting story, you can change the difficulty at any time. This choice will not affect the story. If you are playing alongside me, which I do not expect, but if you are, and you want it to be as difficult as possible, play on hard, not merciless. This says it's the most difficulty, the most difficult setting, but merciless triples um, weakness damage, which is highly abusable by the player. So this actually ends up being somewhat easier than hard mode. If you want it to be as hard as possible, take hard. I'm gonna go normal. Let's do it. Let's do it. You should know your place. Sign here. It's a confession under your name. I see. I need your hand to sign this, but... I don't care if you end up losing a leg. Don't expect to walk out of here in one piece. We are going to make you understand. One must take full responsibility for their actions. We are busted, but for what? Let's get our name in here. Uh, use the keyboard to enter a name. Let me use my uh, username for things, because even though this is mostly for me, I don't want to use my real name on something that's going online. So let's use typo. 
Master. And of course, there's a typo in Master. Typo Master, that's my name. Um, actually, you know what? Let me rewrite that. Let's go with the uh, canon name. Let's do that instead. No, stop. How do I go back? <laughs> Click on this. Here we go. Akira... No. <laughs> what is happening? How do I go back? Uh, uh-oh. There we go. Wow, that was a lot of work. Let's use the canon name. Akira Kurusu. I spelled that wrong. Do we like that more than Typo Master? It's, it's like, actually a name. So, sure, we'll use the canon name for this playthrough. Sounds good. I'm finished. Excuse me, but this area is off. I'm Nijima from the Public Prosecutor's Office. The Prosecutor's Office? What business do you have here? Just let me through. It's urgent. There's something I need to confirm with the suspect. Nijima-san, I believe this case is no longer in your jurisdiction. Besides... Are you Prosecutor Sai Nijima? I just got off the phone with your director. Hurry and get it over with. To be frank, you're being an inconvenience. <laughs> I thought I ordered you to stand by. I'm responsible for this case, yet I'm not even being allowed an interrogation? I'm calling because I knew you'd bring it up. I will not be convinced unless I confirm it for myself. This is my case. Uh, good luck to you then. I won't be expecting much though. Ah, Prosecutor, I forgot to mention something important. Your time will be cut short. We can't permit you to talk with him for long. <sighs> it's for your own sake. His methods are unknown, after all. We don't even know if it's safe to simply meet and speak with him. I understand. I didn't expect it'd be you. You'll be answering my questions this time. Can you hear me? It seems you've been through a lot. Almost anything can happen here, and I can't stop them. That's why I need you to answer me honestly. I don't have much time either. What was your objective? Why did you cause such a major incident? I didn't think it was a prank from the get-go, but I couldn't assemble a case for prosecution. It's because I couldn't figure out the method behind it. Of course you couldn't. <laughs> True. There's no way I could be convinced of such a world just by reading the reports. It seems you're coherent. When and where did you find out about that world? How is it even possible to steal another's heart? Now, tell me your account of everything. Start from the very beginning. And there you have it. So this is six months in the future. And now we're going to go back to, I guess, what you would call present time. No, we're going to go back to the past, more like. Let's save, yeah. Definitely. My first save on PC. Yay. 21 minutes already, whoa.
gentlemen, thank you for riding with us today. We will be arriving in Shibuya shortly. This is the last stop for this line. Please transfer here for all subway lines. The doors to your left will open. <laughs> We got arrested for helping a lady who needed it. Mental shutdown? That's messed it's up. The truth. To a person though? <laughs> That's got to be a joke. You really love all that occult stuff, don't you? <laughs> Heart of Tokyo. Where the game takes place. Well, after meeting him, I get the feeling that's what's going on. Huh? And tomorrow's task is sure. <laughs> it's so sick. That app stops time and makes me have visions. Better delete it. <laughs> Imagine. That is not what you would do. I don't believe you for a second if that's what you say you would do. I don't believe you for a second. Hints. If you're ever confused about what to do or where to go next, look to the upper right corner of the screen to view various hints. Head to your new lodging. Exit the subway station. Alright, and that is the prologue. Next time we get started on April 9th. Oh, I'm so excited. It's gonna be so good. You gotta figure out all the controls and stuff. Oh, I can't save here. To hell with it then. Let's just keep going. We're gonna do April 9th too, as well. Jesus, I got the hiccups. This music is so good. Starting today, Sojiro Sakura will be taking care of me, my guy. His house should be in the back streets of this residential area. If you use I, J, K, and L, you'll be able to rotate the camera? No, I'll use the mouse, but thank you. If you press C or R, you can bring the camera back to its default position. Okay. You can adjust the speed and direction of the camera's rotation in config. Rotate the camera to look around you and the people near you. Talking to people. All sorts of people live in the city. Try listening to their conversations or press space to talk to them. You might learn something new. Yeah, I'm definitely just going to move the mouse. I might turn up the sensitivity of it. But yeah. Is there a way I can walk instead? I gotta figure out how to walk. What was that? Oh, what was that? Um, sorry, never mind. Really? Okay, yeah, I, I, I understand. What will I do? I'm feeling under the weather, but I've got an important meeting tomorrow. I thought I'd give this place a shot, but they said they were closed for the day. And it's still so early, too. I just can't believe it. Maybe I should go in and ask again. Like a clinic that closes at... in the afternoon? <laughs> Interesting. I don't think the address I'm looking for is up ahead. Alright. Oh, look at the minimap! How did I miss that? This thing is massive on the screen! Okay. Oh, God. 
god, this game is so stylish, it's unbelievable. I was so caught in. I can feel the chilly air flowing out from inside the store. That's a high AC bill, I bet. Cats. Now there's gotta be a way to run, or to walk. Um, here we go. I'll have to figure it out later. Yeah, I'll have to figure it out later. And I'll figure out the sensitivity as well. Was there another, uh, accident? I see a policeman over there. Always just watching to make sure everyone is safe. It'd be scary if something like that happened again, though. Let's hurry home. What happened exactly? I don't think the address I'm looking for is up ahead. Then let's go this way. Sojiro Sakura's house. The nameplate here says Sakura. Looks like this might be Sojiro Sakura's house. Got that very tiny front yard that's all concrete, so why even have it? Even after ringing the doorbell, it doesn't look like anyone will answer the door. Maybe he's gone out. Looks like no one's home. Oh, yeah. Sakura san's usually at his cafe around this time. Well, it belongs in the back alley, so I should make my other deliveries first. Hmm. Next, I need to take this package to. Okay, so we need to go to LeBlanc. Or LeBlanc. One of those. LeBlanc or LeBlanc? I'm gonna wait for more people to say it, because sometimes I forget which one it is. But I love that place. I'm all about it. That's messed up! <laughs> I remember that I remember that line. Dude, look how many good things are here. Secondhand shop. Store owner isn't here right now. There's a sign that reads on break. It looks like this place also handles electronics. You might be able to buy stuff here for cheap. Yeah, and you could steal here for cheap too. I mean, they're not even here. It's kind of crazy. I wouldn't do that in real life or in the game, but as a as a like an owner of a business, I would not just leave it open like that. Oh, here it is. My little cubby right here. With the, you got the laundry here. Examine the dryer. I can examine it. They're clothes spinning inside. <laughs> I bet. Washing machine is pretty dirty. Maybe it's because it's been used for a long time. Yikes. Vending machine. Not thirsty right now. Apparently not. And there's the bathhouse. It's the bathhouse. The pleasant smell of soap wafts this way. For now, I should look for a store called LeBlanc. Or LeBlanc. I'm gonna, I'm gonna say LeBlanc until I know better. Here we are, Cafe LeBlanc, coffee and curry. I wish I could read Japanese so I understood that sign. I know that one yen is basically one cent, so 400 yen is like four dollars, but that's all I understand out of that sign. Looks like this place is LeBlanc. Yeah, I'll go inside. Let's go say hello. Frightening. What could be going on? Didn't something similar happen just the other day? And down is uh, the name of a shellfish used in pearl farming. Oh, right. They did say that was today. Now we'll be going. That's my guy. It's on the table. Thanks for coming. Yeah, this place is in the back alley, so there's no worries of a car crashing in here. A what now? Yeah, <laughs> yeah, he's like, what? Those rampage accidents, you know. I just hope that none happen around here. It's none of my concern. <laughs> well, see you next time. Oh, four hours for just a single cup. Joe. Look at this man. So, you're the guy. Uh, so, I thought this was super weird the first time I saw it, but apparently in Japan it's common courtesy to say, please take care of me in this situation. Um, <laughs> in English, that's a super weird thing to say, please take care of me. But in Japan, it's like, normal. Uh, that's like, manners. And we can assume that this is the right guy. Uh-huh. I'm Sojiro Sakura. You'll be in my custody over the next year. I was wondering what kind of unruly kid would show up. But you're the one, huh? Have you been told? A customer of mine and your parents know each other, and, well, not that that matters. 
Follow me. <laughs> I love LeBlanc. I would definitely get coffee there, 100%. This is your room. Perfect. I'll at least give you sheets for your bed. Hmm? You look like you want to say something. It's big. It's on you to clean up the rest. I'll be leaving after I lock up each day. You'll be alone at night, but don't do anything stupid. I'll throw you out if you cause any trouble. Looks now, like we're on thin ice. I got the gist of your situation. You protected some woman from a man forcing himself on her. He got injured, then sued you, right? That's what you get for sticking your nose in a matter between two adults. You did injure him, yeah? And now that you've got a criminal record, you were expelled from your high school. Dude, what a bad hand. Transfer and move out here, which your parents also approved. In other words, they got rid of you for being a pain in the ass. It's best you not talk about anything unnecessary. I am in the restaurant business, you know. Behave yourself for the year. If nothing happens, your probation will be lifted. The whole year. Cause any problems and you'll be sent straight to Juvie. We'll be going to Shujin tomorrow. Shujin? Shujin Academy. The school you'll be attending. We'll introduce ourselves properly to the staff there. There's rarely a place to accept someone like you, you know? What a waste of my Sunday. Your luggage arrived. Sorry, man. <laughs> I brought it up here for you. I'll be living here starting today. I should check out what's in here. So that was Coffee Dad. <laughs> I'm gonna call him Coffee Dad a lot because that's basically what he is. He's our caretaker for the next year. So he's kind of like a dad figure and he sells coffee. <laughs> I don't know when I started saying that or what, but just be prepared. I'm gonna call him Coffee Dad a lot. Junk littered floor. Brilliant! All these unused household items lying here, it's not organized at all. Shelf with old. That's so many books. Some parts of these shelves have rust on them. All these difficult looking books were carelessly crammed in it. Cluttered work desk with even more books. It's a desk with a stack of books on top. No one can use this as a desk while it's like this. Oh, I'm so excited. I'm sorry. I'm like geeking. I'm getting goosebumps just thinking about the things I can do in this room, in this game. It's a table covered in dust. If I draw a line in the dust with my finger, it'll probably be really easy to see. Here's my stuff. It's a cardboard box sent from back home. It's full of clothes and daily necessities. I'll change into more comfortable clothes for now. Start cleaning first. Yeah, let's do it. It's gonna take a long time to clean like that. There's our stuff. Were those coffee beans on the shelf right there? I bet this room smells good if it smells like coffee beans. With a coffee shop downstairs? It's late. Seems like I've been cleaning for a while. Yeah, so most of our April 9th is going to be taken up cleaning our room. <laughs> looks hey, looks better though. I heard you making all sorts of noise up here, but I didn't think you were cleaning. Actually, the place doesn't look too bad. Though it's only natural you'd want to keep your room tidy. Why don't you go to bed for tonight? You don't have anything better to be doing, right? I'm going to close up shop and get out of here myself. I won't be the one looking after you if you get sick from staying up too late. You got that? How to advance time. Going to bed is a special action that will advance time. Yep. Time is limited. Think carefully about your schedule before you act. That's what I was talking about at the beginning. We have so much time each day to be able to do things. Um, but I don't think there's anything else I can do on this day. Yeah. So this was April 9th. And the prologue. All that good stuff. And tomorrow, April 10th. I play I played this before April 9th because I thought I'd be able to save after the prologue, but whatever. We're here. I'll play April 10th on April 10th. Thank you so much for watching. If for some reason you're joining me. <laughs> if you enjoyed the video, consider giving a like. And if you really enjoyed it, never mind, we're saving. <laughs> we can't save! Change to go to sleep. <laughs> Starting today, this is my room. When is it going to let me save? <laughs> Criminal record. Damn brat. I'll sue. 
still, I just couldn't let that go. <sighs> that day. I ended up going home late. I guess we're still in the prologue, to be honest. I can hear a man and a woman arguing in the distance. I think they're just up ahead. How dare you yeah, that's messed up. If I saw that, I'd do something too. I'm just saying. No! Don't give me that shit. Looks like that drunk man is bothering that woman. She's in danger. Can't. Yeah, I can't ignore this. Exactly. What a waste of time. You think you're worth causing me trouble, huh? I'll, I'll call the police. Call them if you want. The police are my bitches. They're not going to take you seriously. No. Stop. Someone called the cops, huh? Get in the car. Incompetent fools like you just need to shut your mouths and follow where I steer this country. What are you looking at? Get out of my face. This ain't a show. You're lost, kid. See? This is all because you're so damn slow. Get in the car. That's jacked up. Pie 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 pie. <laughs> Courtesy of my roommate for that one. It's that weird app that somehow ended up on my phone. The icon almost looks like an eye. It definitely looks like an eye. I thought I, I, thought I deleted it. He just deletes it again. <laughs> uh, it's trying to make him the main character of his own story and he said nope. Not for me! Jesus. Not creepy at all. Trickster, welcome to my velvet room. <laughs> That's Igor, baby. And that's the guy's voice from the beginning. Come to, inmate. The you in reality is currently fast asleep. You are only experiencing this as a dream. You're in the presence of our master. Stand up straight. Welcome. I am delighted to make your acquaintance. This place exists between dream and reality, mind and matter. It is a room that only those who are bound by a contract may enter. I am Igor, the master of this place. Remember it well. I summoned you to speak of important matters. It involves your life as well. Important matters. Still, this is a surprise. The state of this room reflects the state of your own heart. To think a prison would appear as such. You truly are a prisoner of fate. In the near future, there is no mistake that ruin awaits you. Ruin? I speak of the end to everything. However, there is a means to oppose such a fate. 
You must be rehabilitated. Rehabilitated toward freedom. That is your only means to avoid ruin. Do you have the resolve to challenge the distortion of the world? Yeah, wait, what? <laughs> you didn't decline, hmm. Very well, that is enough. Allow what? me to observe the path of your rehabilitation. Ah, pardon me for not introducing the others. To your right is Caroline. To your left, Justi. They serve as wardens here. Ha! Try and struggle as hard as you like! The duty of wardens is to protect inmates. We are also your collaborators. That is, if you remain obedient. I shall explain the roles of these two at another occasion. Now then, it seems the night is waning. It is almost time. Take your time to slowly come to understand this place. We will surely meet again, eventually. How trippy is that? April 10th of 20 something. <laughs> 20XX. I had a strange dream. Ruin rehabilitation? What does it mean? Looks like you're up. Look at Coffee Dad stunt! Well then, let's go introduce <laughs> ourselves properly to the staff about your transfer. The school you're attending is in the Aoyama district. It'll take a while to get there by train. The transfers are a real hassle, too. I'll drive you there, but just for today. Let's go. Men aren't usually allowed in my passenger seat. <laughs> Only Sojiro can, can work looking like that and saying those things. Damn, looks like we're doing April 10th anyway. Do me a favor and behave yourself, alright? Don't get me wrong. I don't care what happens to you. Just don't cause me any trouble. All right, I'm on it. We got this. To reiterate, just so we're clear, look at this man. You'll immediately be expelled if you cause any problems. In my opinion, you're nothing but a liability. But we had our circumstances to consider. Whatever you might have gotten away with in your hometown, those days are over. If you are thrown out from our school, there will be no place for you to go. Keep that in mind. This is the teacher in charge of your class. I'm Sadayo Kawakami. Here's your student ID. Kawakami! I love this chick! Be sure to read the school rules. Any violations will send you straight to the guidance office. And if by chance you cause any problems, I won't be able to protect you at all. That is your promise, yes, Principal Kobayakawa? Mm hmm He is responsible for all his actions. But really, though, why me? There should have been better candidates. It was a sudden transfer, and your class was the only one that had an opening. If you're done explaining things, mind if we get going? I got a store to get back to. Sakura-san, please keep a close eye on him. Don't let him cause any trouble outside. Well, I'll be sure to have a serious talk about the situation he's in. Come to the faculty office when you arrive at school tomorrow. I'll show you to your classroom. Thank you. Everyone's giving you the cold shoulder. Yeah, I know it's what tough. What criminal record does to you. <laughs> Turns out your past follows you wherever you go. By the way, if you get expelled now, I won't hesitate to kick you out. Got it? I'll be careful. School never changes, huh? Come on, we're going home. What a troublesome situation. I can't believe they pushed someone with a record on me. A male teacher would be better suited for this. Look at the size this. difference. Why in the world was someone like that admitted here? Who knows? It was the principal's decision. I was told that it's for the school's reputation. I would have thought that my volleyball team has contributed more than enough to cover that. That's certainly true. Be careful, okay? Then again, if anything were to happen, I'd kick out a student like that right away. 
Well, I keep wishing that he'd just end up not coming to school. Still, that isn't something I should be saying as a teacher. <laughs> well, I should be returning to practice. Oh, right. The tournament's coming up, isn't it? <laughs> Having such high expectations placed on you by others is quite a problem in itself. We'll have to work hard to make up for the track team, too. Damn, random yes, burn on the track that's team. that's true. Why'd it have to be my class? <laughs> She's really on that. Ugh, traffic's not moving at all. You're taking the train starting tomorrow. So, how was it? The school, I mean. Think you can manage? This car is so tiny. What kind of car are we in? <laughs> Seems fun. I'm so stoked. <sighs> Do you even understand your situation? Still, you were expelled once already. <laughs> to think you'd re-enroll at a different one. It's not like anyone will be sympathetic with you. If that's what it was like at school, people might say stuff about me in the future, too. What a troublesome kid I've taken in. Why did you take me in? I was asked to do it, and I just happened to agree to it. Uh, I've already been paid for it, too, after all. And now, back to today's top stories. A subway train has derailed, severely affecting the timetable across all of... Oh, another accident. So that's why it's so crowded. There's been a lot of those lately. Uh-huh. In fact, there was a real sad one just last month. It happened before you came here. If I remember right, the girl that passed away was only 15. Her parents have got to be just... All traffic around Shibuya Station is being redirected due to the accident, so drivers should expect jam-packed streets. Oh, come on. That sucks. Traffic sucks. He dropped an F-bomb. He said, oh no. Damn. Imagine. That was direct footage from the accident. According to the police, the engineer's life was not in danger despite his injuries. After questioning, even he could not explain his high speed when approaching the station. No further comments were made. Police are still looking for a plausible motive. It's less of an operating accident and more of a crime of the company and the government. Site inspectors apparently reported all of this six months ago. The deterioration of the tracks and the ATC. Seems a railway company and the Ministry of Transport both turned a blind eye to the truth. There's no way they can hide. This will go all the way to the top. Now on to our main story. With this derailment accident, as well as other recent incidents of unknown motive, concern is spreading among the general public. Just what could be causing such a drastic change so suddenly in these people? SNN has Everything's linked. That's what you're thinking, correct? Hmm. Oh well. Are you free? You and I haven't gone for a drink in a while. Thank you, sir. But I have another meeting to attend. I must be going. I was I was ready to go for this meeting, and that's when this extremely fast train just came crashing in. Oh man, I thought I was gonna die. A noisy subway platform filled with people was suddenly. Did you ask for me? Is it a case? Not quite. I want your opinion on something. Sure. Your judgment is quite often correct, though. Can we discuss this over sushi, perhaps? You are making a student work late, after all. Conveyor belt only. <laughs> hey, it's still free food, bro. Get it. Back at Cafe LeBlanc. Damn, to think there'd be that much traffic. 
What a waste of time. I know our whole day's gone. To cafe today. <sighs> Whatever. Just head upstairs. There's something I need to give to you. Talk about a gruesome accident. 80 people were involved. Here's a diary. Make sure you keep it up to date. You may be under probation, but there's no special limitations on what you do in particular. Besides following the law, that is. However, I'm obligated to report on you, which is why I'm having you record your daily activities. Hi, pie, pie, pie. All right. Hey, what's up? I'm about to leave right now. Don't worry. I'll be there in no time. Uh -huh. I'll see you soon. Well, I'm off. I'll lock the place up. So do whatever you want for the rest of the night. Oh, but don't mess up my store. If something goes missing, I'll hand you right over to the cops. You got school tomorrow. You better head off to bed, all right? Okay. Isn't that music, though? Doesn't that just make you bop to it? I should do as I'm told for now. I should write down what happened in my diary today. You can save your game by pressing H. Interesting. When you see the button command in the lower left, you can save at any time. You need to get her up early tomorrow? I should get plenty of rest today. I'll just add this. Uh, can I do anything about this? Some household items are just lying on the ground in disarray. I can barely even see the floor. No, I can't do anything about this yet. Bunch of books carelessly thrown on the shelves. Let's do it. All right, let's go ahead and save, and then this will be where we leave off for our first episode. I know it was a it was a prologue plus two days, but normally you will be able to save each day, so this won't be a normal thing. This is probably a longer episode than most. But thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, consider giving a like. And if you really enjoyed it, consider subscribing. All that good stuff. But totally, just I would I would honestly urge you rather than watch my videos. Play this game. It is that good, I promise. Thank you all so much for being here. And I will see all of you on April 11th next time.